first day of the project, we met in our assigned groups to start finding paintings. After looking at many different paintings and photographs, we found several candidates. We decided on the portrait of Madame X, painted by John Singer Sargent in the years 1883 to 1884. The original portrait can be found in the Metropolitan Museum of Art in New York City, New York. Madame X was a fairly simple painting, and Alexandra's build and complexion matched the painting's subject quite well. We knew that because of the similarity, the only major obstacle in recreating the painting would be finding the rough, right props and lighting. The first task our group tackled was finding the dress. After this was ordered online, we met at Maya's house and started putting together Alexandra's outfit, included the beaded straps, brooches, hair, and makeup. This took us about two hours because of, because of difficulty with the cut of the dress. Since Madame X has an extremely pale complexion, we had to put the lightest foundation we could find all over Alexandra's exposed skin. Maddie did her makeup, Maya did a French twist, and Nick work on, worked on lighting. Throughout the process, we continuously compared our progress to the painting to be as accurate as possible. When looking at the photo, we were struck by its simplicity and elegance. When replicating the painting, our goal was to create a photo with the same beauty and elegance presented. We wanted to make the viewer of our photograph feel the same way as they would looking at the original Madame X. The second time we met, we focused on backdrops and lighting using curtains as the backdrop. We repositioned several lamps and heavy duty lights several times to find the right placement and angles. We had some difficulty in finding a similar and inexpensive table. The curtains had complications with staying secured against the wall and getting out the wrinkles. We hand painted the fan in the centers of the brooches black. We used trash bags to give a layered effect to the bottom of the dress. The first time we used trash bags, we only had pink ones. Alexandra had to stay in position so she would not mess up Nick's work on the lighting and getting the right shadows. We painted parts of the trash bags black to lessen its reflections from the light. In this project, attention to detail and making adjustments is very important. The third time we got together was for the actual photo shoot. This took us three hours from starting setup to snapping and cropping the final shot. Due to the fact that we were restricted from using editing software, we repositioned Alexandra many times and fixed lighting before taking the final photo. We had to pay close attention to details, such as reddening Alexandra's ear to slight differences in body positioning to finding the right amount of lighting to get the accurate shadows. We changed the bottom section of the backdrop at the last minute to different curtains that match the actual portrait better. Leave some room between your left arm and the dress. Yep. Hang on, Matt, don't take the picture, we're still closing it. Okay, drop your left, right shoulder. Raise your left shoulder. Raise your chin. 
no god in the at all. Okay, right there. Okay, um, raise your chin a little more. Uh, not raise even your there. right side strap a little more. <laughs> together to complete the writing portions of the project and to choose the most accurate photo. In the end, we are very pleased with our results in replicating the portrait of Madame X.